Hi, I'm Anton DeBasquale. And I'm Emily Duggan. And welcome to Penrite DIY. Hi, and welcome to Penrite DIY. Today we're going to be talking about automatic transmission fluid. We're going to be talking about how to check it and also top it off if it needs any. So looking at your engine bay, you're going to be looking for a dipstick. This dipstick has a TF on it, meaning automatic transmission fluid. So that's the one to check. Now the car is currently in idle. It's really important that the car is either at idle uh, for operating temperature or uh, you've been driving it for a bit and um, the car is then in working temperature. So taking this out here, get a clean rag and just wipe off anything so that we get a clear and precise reading. So you'll notice on this dipstick there's two sides to it. Here you'll see 20 degrees Celsius and a line. You'll check this side of the dipstick when the car is simply just at idle. Going over to the other side, this is your hot side. So when the car has actually been running and working for a little bit. That bottom line is, means that it's low and that top line means that the fluid is at the perfect level. Now, since we've only had it idling and not running, we'll flip to the cold side and you can see here that this car's running a little bit low. So we're gonna have to top her up. So now we know that she's low and we're gonna have to top her up. You'll check your Penrite app to make sure that you've got the correct oil and also how much. Uh, pro tip with this is always checking before you walk out of the store. Unlike me, I'll just walk out with one bottle. You need to make sure that this has seven liters. This is only four liters, so we'll be needing two. You'll also need a funnel and of course, some rags. So where we got the dipstick from is the same place that we're going to fill the fluid up from. You'll get your funnel. Now this doesn't fit quite nicely in there, so I'm just going to wrap the rag just around there, just to make sure that if I accidentally move or anything, I'm not going to get the fluid all over the engine bay. Holding that tight in there. So it said we needed seven litres, but we do have a little bit in there already. So I'm gonna fill it up just a little bit by little bit and keep checking it just to make sure that I don't overfill it. So taking that out, put it to the side just for a moment and let's check it. Now, since we had the car idling when we checked it the first time, we are gonna have it idle again to check it the second time. So move your tools out the way and let's start her up. So checking it again. So now we're at the perfect level for the car being at idle, which is 20 degrees. So making sure that when you are finished, you do put that dipstick back in nice and tight. Uh, we will check a little bit later once the car is at complete operating temperature and we've driven around. Just to double check it, it's always good. Remember, measure twice, cut once. Just making sure that all your tools are out of the engine bay and it's that simple. That's how you check and also top up your automatic transmission fluid.